once again we thank God for coming your way. I know you've been blessed. Of course, we have God on our side. This is another exciting program coming your way. Be encouraged as you have heard about it. May the Lord God bless you and lift you up above all things in Jesus' name. Once again, let me pray with you. Father, in the name of Jesus, we give you praise and glory and honor. We commit ourselves into your hands. We pray, O oh God, that your grace will continue to sustain us, encourage us, empower us, embolden us, as you have said. We give you praise, we give you glory in Jesus' mighty name. May the Lord God bless you and your family in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Once again, let us encourage ourselves. Turn your Bible with me if you can. So Mark chapter 10, verse number 46. I want to quickly read it through. Now they came to Jericho. And as they went out of Jericho with his disciples and a great multitude, blind Bartimaeus, the son of Timaeus, sat by the road begging. And when he heard that it was Jesus of Nazareth, he began to cry out and say, Jesus, son of David, have mercy on me. Then many warned him to be quiet. But he cried out all the more, Son of David, have mercy on me. 49. So Jesus stood still and commanded him to be called. And when they called the blind man, saying to him, Be of good cheer, rise up, he is calling you. Bible says that throwing aside his garment, he rose and came to Jesus. So Jesus answered and said to him, what do you want me to do for you? What a powerful way. What do you want me to do for you? And he responded by saying, the blind man said to him, Rabboni, that I may receive my sight. And Jesus said to him, go your way. Your faith has made you well. And immediately he received his sight and followed Jesus on the road. What are we saying? Child of God, it is the same way we are coming your way. The Lord God has spoken into your life. Your situation will challenge you. People will challenge you. A lot of things may be said, uh, spoken about you, but that doesn't describe you. All you need to know is what God is saying in your life. And that is what we are here today to echo on it. He says that even when they said to him, shut up, Bible says that he continued to pray out. So what are we saying? We want to encourage you today, whatever that you are going through, don't give up. Don't write yourself up. Don't think that it is enough. No, there is still more in you that you have no idea of. May the Lord God bless you as you take the word of God the same way blind Bartimaeus did that you carry on with what God has said to you and you will know that you will bring nothing but a change in your life and people will recognize the hand of God and they will be blessed. Be encouraged. May the Lord God strengthen you and empower you. And finally, Jesus said to him, your faith has made you well. So we pray as you continue in the word of God, as you pray, as you seek the face of God, may the power of God vested in you Bring about the glory of God. God bless you until we come your way again. Remember, conquer fear, find hope, be encouraged. See you again. Bye-bye.